Why white people like country music? Let's. I don't know. Go. I just moved to New York this year, and uh, yeah, it's all right. New York's all right. It's nice. I, I like it more than I thought I would, but uh, I just just found out I was fat. Just I'm 31. I just this year found out that I was a fat guy. I'm from a white trash enough town that Shane Gillis is 31. I thought he was way older than that. What? This was killing it. Wait, how long? Was it? People back home see me. They're like, "What's your fucking secret?" I'm like, "Oh, I'm just hanging out, man." <laughs> He's Midwestern. <laughs> I know. Then, I'm I don't from know. The I US. moved. Uh, I moved to Philly first. I lived in Philly for like two years. Yeah, gay birds. And then, uh, the but it was funny because I moved the, like the from a white wild. trash town to Philly like right during the presidential election. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> you, you pussies. Uh, no, but it was funny because like that was a big jump. I went from like an all white trash town to then to the city where now all my new friends were like real woke. And that was like, cause if, like, if this was my hometown, someone could just walk in here in full camouflage and sit down and you'd be like, that's a fucking good outfit. <laughs> are you, are you trying to get pussy in here tonight, dude? Come on, man. You're going full camo at Clusterfest, all right? Like everybody I grew up with listens to country music and I don't, but I get it. Like I understand why white people like it, you know? Like you can relate to it. You can understand all the lyrics. You don't need to Google what a nene is. <laughs> it's not, I don't know if you know this, every country song's just about exactly what a white guy's doing at that moment. It's like, I turn the radio up. It's like, yeah, fuck yeah. That's good, that's music, that's what I like. I get it, you can relate to it. I ride around, I listen to rap, that's all I listen to. I can't relate to one fucking song. That's I just ride true. around this, by myself, bob my head, just like, I beat the real. pussy up. It's like, oh, huh. <laughs> I, I, like, I don't know if I beat it up. Like, I'm like, I'll shadow box the pussy. I've never, I've never knocked it out. Everyone's knocking out pussy. These, I've oh, never knocked it out. Not, uh, I'm more like Floyd Mayweather with a pussy. Very technical. <laughs> very defensive. Floyd Mayweather is crazy. He said, I'll shadow box it. Everybody, that is a fact, though. All y'all niggas talk about, man, I'll beat it up, nigga. Now I knock it out. I bet if we talk to your partners, they might have, you think? <laughs> might have something to say about that one. That's all I listen to. I just ride around and listen to people brag about how good they are at sex. <laughs> I don't think I've ever made a girl make a sound with my dick. <laughs> <laughs> Except like when I lay on them at first and they're like, <laughs> <laughs> That's it, just, oh, Jesus, mister. <laughs> By the way, our light goal for this video, I gotta set one new page, you gotta set it for every. We let's get a hundred likes on this page. And for more Shane Gillis reactions, make sure in the comment section you tell me the next one I should react to. Matter of fact, let's get to 200. We can do that. We're on the road yeah. to a thousand subscribers. Good. So that's where I'm from. And then I moved to the city. And here, let me lose you again real quick. Uh it was right during the presidential election, and uh, it was funny because all my friends went from like white trash to like I said woke, and they were all like, they're all like, did you guys all vote Democrat? Did anybody here vote? <laughs> do you guys do you guys remember how like confident you guys were <laughs> going into that last one? Huh? You remember that? A little borderline arrogant going into that. All right, don't let it cost you again. No, I relax, relax. I did not vote for him. Yeah, fuck yeah. <laughs> no, I, act I actually did not vote for him, which that was tough. Is Look at me. me. Oh, Donald Trump, okay. His whole campaign was at me. <laughs> I was watching TV, he was like, are you a fucking fat idiot? I was like, yeah, dude. <laughs> yeah, what are we doing? What the fuck are we doing, dude? We're building walls? Hell yeah. <laughs> I took I skull out of my Trump. mouth to come up here. <laughs> and I didn't vote for Donald Trump. Okay, Makes me like the Nelson Mandela of central Pennsylvania. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. You guys are all right. <laughs>
I want you guys to know, though, I do have black friends. <laughs> Nothing scares me more than when a white person says, No! I'm not racist! I got black friends! I go, ooh, hey. Ooh. I'll just put it like this. I've never heard somebody who wasn't being accused of something racist <laughs> say that. I've never. Friends. I've never heard it. <laughs> No, it's nice having black friends when the rest of your friends are just fucking goofy white guys. It's nice. You get some outside perspective, some advice. You just got to be careful of the advice you take from your black friends when it comes to, like, sex. When you look like Uncle Buck, it doesn't <laughs> translate. Like, this is the advice my friend gave me when I went on a date with this chick. He was like, hey, yo, Shane, you don't want to go too deep in the pussy. She's always going to want the dick. I was like, you're, you're worried about depth? <laughs> like, depth is a problem? I didn't even know they had depth. I'm just happy to be there. You're worried about, like, depth is an issue? He was like, you don't want to give her the whole dick. I'm like, that's all I have. <laughs> what are you talking about? I've never been, like, halfway in and been like, oh, oh. You got to earn the rest of this <laughs> dick. It's insane. Depth? Nah, he cook it. That's crazy. <laughs> I'm worried about, like, the noises I'm making. <laughs> like I just I just sound like like a shitty ghost the whole time. Just like, <laughs> 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 it's almost done. <laughs> nah, this is the this is the best Shane Gill's clip I've, I've I've seen so far. I'm really new to Shane Gill's stand up. I go, I know who he is, of course. Just I've never actually watched his stand up to his channel. So y'all educate me. I'm here to learn. Like I said, let me know what I should react to, man. We in this together. Depth. Or my face? You ever worry about your face when you're fucking? Don't do it. Don't, don't think about how dumb you look. You'll end up looking like a fucking psycho trying to look handsome the whole just. It's not good. It's worse for me if I let it go. Like if I just let my face go during sex. Like I, I look like Brandon Dassey from Making a Murderer the whole just. girls down there and she's like did you do it I'm like, oh, no. <laughs> not his Brandon Dassey face I'm sorry I need that one more time Brandon Dassey from making a murderer the whole just <laughs> girls down there and she's like oh, did you do God. it I'm like, oh, no. <laughs> yeah <laughs> okay oh my god Shane Gillis reminds me of too many people I grew up with Alright, uh, if you like this, make sure you check out my last video, which is Shane Gillis' SNL monologue. We are getting this channel to the algorithm. I'm going to keep dropping videos. We're going to keep going. We're on the road to 1,000 subscribers, man. Let's go.